And now for this weekend, Argo Athletics. The number 5 UWF women's soccer team extended its winning streak to 8 in a 4-0 win over Delta State in its Senior Day match Sunday afternoon. Senior Alex Pickle scored the game winner in the 10th minute for her first goal of the season. Really, I'm just happy for all of us for the win. Um, it was just the icing on the cake that I actually scored a goal for once. So. West Florida broke its school record unbeaten streak with its 26th consecutive match without a loss and a 4-0 win over Christian Brothers Friday night. The University of West Florida men's soccer team defeated Delta State 4-0 on Senior Day. UWF has now clinched the Gulf South Conference regular season championship and are now 11-4-1 on the season. Yeah, it was just a team contribution, you know, people coming off the bench. Everybody contributed, the whole team. West Florida also defeated Christian Brothers 2-0 on Friday. The West Florida men's cross country team had seven runners earn all conference honors on Saturday as the team placed second at the Gulf South Conference Championships. Tim Wenger was the top performer for West Florida and finished fourth overall. It was definitely one of the better races I had this season. The team did really well as well. The West Florida women's cross country team finished second at the Gulf South Conference Championship in Hoover, Alabama on Saturday morning. The Argonauts were led by senior Renee Porsche who finished fifth overall. The number 21 ranked West Florida volleyball team defeated Lee University 3-0 at the 7th annual Packet Pink match on Saturday. Senior Abby Timmer led the Argonauts on the day with eight block assists, while fellow senior Lindsey Hami tallied six. I think today it showed a lot um, that our practice, we've been practicing blocking together and coming in and really shutting down the um, outsides on the other team. West Florida also defeated GSC opponent Shorter 3-1 at home on Friday night. The number 13 UWF women's golf team closed out the St. Leo Invitational with a sixth place finish last Tuesday. The Argonauts were led by junior Camilla Seviano, who placed 11th individual. The number nine ranked UWF men's golf team moved up two spots in the final round of the Georgetown Intercollegiate last Tuesday, finishing tied for sixth in the 12 team field. Junior Juan Miguel Heredia led UWF in the final round with a 70 as he finished tied for 21st. Make sure to follow us online at GoArgos.com and our social media channels. That wraps up this week's edition of the Argonaut Weekly Report.